Hello folks, this is Josh from Ted47 with a super quick video slash warning today, tonight, this is going up late. You may have heard this, but more importantly, you may not have, and that is that there's very much an issue with camp vendors. There have been rumors ever since they were returned to us last week in the hot fix that they've been acting weird. The rumor was in some cases they were allowing people to buy things from your stash that were not listed in the vending machine. So someone could come to your shop, scroll through your sales, uh, either on purpose or accidentally, and find things like outfits they had stashed away or that bloodied handmade that you're saving for an alt and buy them for like 20 caps. This was also showing items that you can only get from the Adam shop as well. I didn't recreate this bug, uh, nor did I try to. There's more than enough evidence out there to confirm this is actually happening. I've seen videos, I've seen dozens and dozens of posts about it. This does not seem like a hoax or a rumor, uh, enough so that Bethesda's replied that they're looking into it. The thought is that it is somehow tied to camps with display cases, but information is all over the place. I'd say the best thing to do is just store or scrap your vendors for a day or two. If you're worried about losing items, you do not intend to sell and just maybe keep yourself up to date by visiting the Fallout 76 subreddit and see if there's any information. And I'm going to just assume at some point uh, Bethesda will just once again disable the vendors until they can fix whatever's going on. One day, Bethesda will get this right, I hope. I, I feel kind of bad for them, but I feel like it is becoming more and more obvious as time goes on that, that this engine and or code tied to it is, just does not handle the burdens and rigors of MMO life super well. And I enjoy this game, but I hope they figure this out. They had such a good uh, like week of a uh, good feeling and uh, like people being happy after the release of Wastelanders and, and now people are getting into the grind and these bugs are creeping up and they're rapidly losing that goodwill. And we just want this game to be good. That said, stay safe at home, stay safe and protect your valuables in West Virginia and we'll see you out there.